Hi, Mark Savage here. Garage chat time. What are we going to talk about today? Crappy sound effects, but beep beep. Horns, motorcycle horns. Often, they're pretty piss poor, if I'm honest with you. 50 cc's, you expect this little horn that goes beep if it does. These ones aren't too bad. They're open, you're going to hear them. But I'm talking about mega horns. Now, you're not allowed the Dixie tunes, which are great. And you couldn't, no matter what, have these four or five sets of horns. There's a lot of horns out there from China that look great. These sort of things. They're pretty much exactly the same as them. Just to have a little beat around them. I've had chrome ones, put twins on there. The wires often pull off and they're not that good if I'm honest with you. But what I did find on eBay is this bad boy. This is brilliant. But is it loud? Thumbs up. Got to have a listen. Oh yes. Now if you compare that to these sort of ones. Pretty rubbish. Come on, this is safety. When somebody pulls out in front of you, okay, you're not going to have that much chance. But if someone's trying to cut in on you or anything else, that horn will make them jump out of their socks. They're going to know you're there. Not these little ones I'm talking about. This bad boy. Well worth it. About £17. And you can pay £10 for these. And twin ones of these things. I don't know, I keep picking it up. Just throw it away now. You've got to have the room on your bike, admittedly. A ped. You may better squeeze it somewhere, but I really do like them. What else am I going to talk about today, though, while we're in the garage? Do you remember my last video? Batteries. I keep saying batteries. But batteries. These are new on the market. These are brilliant. What is it? Okay, looks like a one terabyte gig hard drive, but it's not. It's a power pack. It will charge a phone, USB ports, a light, but on this side's the big kit. Tiny little port. You can attach these bad boys. This will jump start any motorcycle, including a car, petrol, and diesel cars. 1.6, 2 litre, stuff like that. Not your big American ones. But for a motorbike, these are brilliant. All prices, this was £40. You can get them up to 80 quid. And it is a case, the more you pay, the better you get. But as you know, this bike was starting a bit slowly. I'm waiting for the battery to arrive. I thought this was well worth buying. And it will sit underneath the back of the seat or in your back box. And for me, this will go under here. If I was driving this bad boy, go in the panniers. Or if you're going for a long ride, I always keep in my little box. So lucky enough in this bike, underneath the back seat, you have a little tool bag. Generally, it's got your general little spanners and so on. And I keep this as well. What's in here? 10 pounds again, tire pack. You get to be able to put, you get a blowout basically, you can put it in there, push in the tire, twist round. Do you know what, I'll do a video of this one day to explain how it works. On the big VN, I've actually also keep. On this one, okay, minus a drink, same kit and a tire inflator. I mean, you might as well if you've got the room to stick them in there. It just makes sense. So this will go here, along with a few accessories. And the bag on top. And then the seat will go back down. Okay, I'll move it a little better than that. But there you go. I know now, my phone died, I could charge it. Oh, that if the battery died, I could also jump start the bike to get him out of trouble. And if I get a flat, at least I could bung it and get to petrol station. But if I've got a back box like this one, I'll also keep one of those cans, just safety riding. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. Keep making them.